I know the Golden Cap, not as a patron, mind you. I designed some specialized devices. I kept the blueprints, if anyone is curious. Don't. I brought you tea as a courtesy to a colleague. I won't make that mistake in the future. I'm sorry, I only thought... Never mind what I thought. Thank you for the tea. I have to get back to the Admiral. He has news for me. Rip. All right. Hello, Corvo. I expect Martin will be joining us shortly. I hate to start your day with such a strange matter, but the servants heard something last night. Moving through the storm drains beneath Yeah, okay. Sewer. I thought I heard a weeper in there earlier. There's two, actually. Probably the bravest man I've ever met. Overseer Martin has arrived. He's with Admiral Havelock now. Yeah, nice. Alright, what's up? What do you want? Corvo. I trust you remember Martin, an overseer before, and perhaps again someday soon. I owe you thanks for my rescue. Indeed. You give... Pendleton's waiting for you on the dock. He's asked to brief you personally. Do I have to? Corvo. Deuces. I'll take you to the Golden Cat when you're ready. I'm ready. I've taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. What is that supposed to mean? I don't want to know. You know what? What's the brothel? I don't want to know what that, do that dude does. I'll get you as close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. I have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holker Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on how you get inside the cat if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks used to fight off the plague. 
I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you're bringing back. Good luck to you. I know Emily Let must me out of the boat. I mean, she is my daughter. Be careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. Attention, Dunwall citizens. Thaddeus Campbell, formerly High Overseer, is no longer in the Hey, you're just the man I was looking for. Slackjaw's wanting to talk to you. Mm, all right, then. That him? Yeah, he's the one. Hey. We got a message for you from Slackjaw. He wants to talk. At the distillery. Alright. Just walk right in, I guess. Thought I was gonna have to stealth my way in again. I don't think they're gonna last much longer in there. That's what they get for taking free swigs from the still. That tainted elixir is bad stuff, I guess. <laughs> Do I still have this key? Nope. Do you have this key? Nope. Easy, easy. You just need a bit. Ain't you heard? Slackjaw keeps the good stuff for itself. The rest of us get one part elixir, three parts water. Oh, that's just to make the swallow of this. Well, I ain't taking no chances on getting play. Drink till you drop, that's my motto. I just did a giant circle. He is a villain if I judge your looks aright. A villain I might have some work for. Somebody put plague in the brute tank. Yeah, it was Half me. Half my men are weepers. Trapped three of them in the distillery. Rest are wandering in the street. Since it's so, and I find myself short of able bodies, I may have a point of interest for you, see? How'd you even know I existed? I'm a ghost, remember? Way I figure it, there ain't nobody worth killing around here except those two Pendletons over at the Golden Cat. I'm right, ain't I? 
Yeah. See, slack your nose. Them boys are twins. Rich, mean, and weird. Worse than most of their ilk. They've been laying low there a while. Not sure why. There's a lot of security at the Golden Cap tonight, though. Special guests and the like. But you're gonna walk in there, dressed like that, and kill the Pendleton brothers? Yeah. Maybe I got a better way to take care of them, too. Bet. If you're doing something for me first, understand? Bet. Someone, I don't know who, is killing my men, taking my territory, stealing my goods. Might be a fellow name of Galvani. I sent my best man to investigate, but he went missing and... Well, now I need someone to find what happened to him. Go to this Galvani's place. He lives nearby off Clavering Boulevard. You do that for me and I'll get your better way into the Golden Cat. Alright, bet. Bro, get out of my way. I just need to figure out how to get the bone charm that's out front. Someone wants to get hurt. Not me. I'm leaving. Okay. Wait a minute. What a mess, huh? Is this the level where Dowd's men appear? Yeah, up anything good? Blow off, chop. It is. Okay. I was about to just run right over there. That would have been a bad idea. <laughs> Look out for the watch. They got no respect for walls. He's gone. sworn there was three assassins. Am I remembering this wrong? Maybe. Oh. No, I'm not. I actually seen this dude when I was over here. I just thought it was a guard on like a ledge or something. All 
part dealer's key. How do I get that key again? Oh my god, I'm trying to remember this game and all I can remember is the second game and Death of the Outsider. A mandatory whale oil ration is now in effect. Non-compliance is a punishable offense. Can I get in through here? Oh, I can. So this is art. Awful lousy way to make coin. Poor bastard. Stuff can't be worth nothing. Can they? Not a chance. I think I remember having seen this painting at my grandmother's place. She wasn't no dungeon. Yeah, probably can't even sell it for junk. Not worth the time taking it off the walls. I might go upstairs, see if the mother two found something worth the trouble. Yeah, it's nice. Oh, there's two more people. Interesting, interesting. <coughs> sleep in here. Wouldn't have such a strong door unless they kept some interesting things. I'm telling you, we'll find you. Not even if you're not. I see any alerts above his head, but they didn't go red. And I think they have to go red for it to matter. Oh god, what's the safe combination? Oh my god, I got it. Buy your ration of elixir from today, please. Not now. Ooh. Yep. Sound like a lot of blood, really. Wish I saw. Not a big deal. Maybe you can go up later and take a look after the mother two are gone.
right here under the table. Alright, well, how would I go? Hey, hey, wait a bit. What just occurred to me? How come it's always me who pay for the whiskey? Shush up your mouth. You know I can't work out the right number of coins. Embarrassing. Looks like they solved the weeper problem here. Is he still staring at the wall? You were staring at the wall when I was here. Alright, well. I guess it's just a really interesting wall. this information from my missing guy. Let's have a listen. Slack Definitely somebody. It's me, Crowley. What? I'm making this in case I don't make it back. He was right. There is someone once you dead. What's the take over the distillery and the whole Bottle Street gang? And you'll never believe who it is either. Got At first I did. That's why it's taking me so I wanted to be sure. What's that? Fire! No! No! Ah! So Crowley's dead. Too bad. He was one of my best men. Sucks for you. Still, you and me had a deal, and Slackjaw never goes back on a deal. Take this key. It ain't for the golden cat, no. This key's for the captain's chair. A hotel abandoned since the plague gutted this part of town. Take the stairs to the top. 
you can use the roof to get into the Golden Cat Brothel. See that? Slackjaw keeps a bargain. Just as good as the men who run the city. Maybe a little better. You think about that. Now maybe we can help each other out again. I could get rid of the Pendletons for you, quiet-like and without killing them. But you gotta do something for me in return. Sure. The cat's having a big reopening tonight. Lot of money clients. Including an arts dealer name of Bunting. He's got particular taste, or so I've been told. Oh, that's right. Day. He wants the safe combination. Got some pretty fancy stuff locked away at his place. And the only thing preventing me from nabbing all that loot is the combination to a safe. Of course, the I remembered it from last time. There for months too, not sure why. There's like two or three so that different means combinations. A lot of city watch and other soldier types. Bring me that combination, my mass friend, and then I take care of the Pendleton brothers, just like that. You ain't never even gonna touch them, and I promise, I won't kill them, and no one will ever see them again. Now, if that ain't a deal, Slackjaw don't know what is. Cool, cool. Um. All right. Got anything to smoke or eat? Want to look at some of the things I've found? Yes. Good prices, I swear. over here so I have to be a little careful. Attention Dunwall citizens. This district is now under a mandatory whale oil ban. Compliance will be strictly enforced. Granny Rags. Come on. Come to dinner now, that's right. Well, sweet little birds. Come to Granny. Granny won't hurt you. Granny is psycho. Have you seen it? The handsome one with the beautiful dark eyes. I just want to tell him I'm doing my part. Yes, Granny Rags is doing her part. Alright, deuces, Granny. Fussing with my collar, Mama. The dance is starting soon. Is my hair smooth enough? He's sure to be there. Um, something's a little batshit insane, but uh, we're just gonna ignore that.
You know nothing. Do they know I'm here? When I find you, it's gonna be I know you're here somewhere, scum. Attention, citizens of Dun- The Lord Regent has ordered strict whale oil rationing in this area. Failure to comply will result in immediate arrest. stop the recording.